Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. I believe we are now on week five of being here in the US. I am from here um, in Southern Utah and then my husband is from Meru, Kenya and we live there. So we live in Kenya, but my kids and I are here in Utah visiting my family and we're here for the holidays. But he was not able to come with us this time because we just have way too much going on. We have, I believe over 70 pigs now. I can't keep up with the number um, because we keep having piglets being born, but we have over 70 pigs and uh, 30 of them are very close to being ready for slaughter. And then at the same time, we also have so much going on with the coffee. We just launched um, our coffee product and we export it here to the US and we have it available for our customers here in the US and also in Kenya. And there's just so much um, on my end that I'm doing here in US for that. And also George is very has been very busy with um, getting our coffee seedlings planted in the ground, taking care of them during this rain season and making sure that, you know, everything is going well. And then about a million other things at the same time. And yeah, so the kids and I are here throughout the holidays. And holidays for us also includes Halloween. Like what we call the holidays is like Halloween, Thanksgiving, and Christmas. We have been in the Halloween mode lately. And tonight we are actually going to what's called a trunk or treat. I'm sure most of you know what trick-or-treating is, but trunk-or-treating is, you'll see, it's like a whole thing. I don't know if it's popular everywhere around the country, but definitely in Utah is. I don't know if it goes along with like Mormon culture or not, um, or if it's just a thing that's like widespread now, but it's basically like you go to a parking lot, we'll go over to the church, and um, people decorate like the backs of their cars, their trunks, of the trunks of their cars, so it's a trunk or treat. And um, then little kids can wear their costumes and walk around and collect candy from <laughs> from the cars. It sounds so weird, but um, it's really fun. And I think we're gonna have like food and stuff over there too. So I'll take you guys along for that. And some of you have asked when we're coming back to Kenya and we will be back after Christmas. So don't worry, I am really missing Kenya. Yeah, I think everyone's about ready to go. We're gonna head over to the church and I'll vlog a little bit over there and show you guys what a trunk or treat is all about, if you don't know. Um, and then last night we went to a family Halloween party with my mom's side of the family, some of her um, siblings. So my mom has seven siblings. So it's a really big family and tons of cousins. I'm actually the oldest cousin. I'm the oldest child in my family and I'm also the oldest cousin like I'm the oldest grandchild on my mom's side of the family as well so I'm just like the oldest and the wisest no just kidding um <laughs> no but I have a lot of little cousins and um yeah so last night we got to spend time with one of my mom's sisters who lives in Salt Lake area but they were down here and then um one of my mom's my mom's youngest brother and another of my mom's sisters, and then my grandma was here too. And my grandpa, I got to see my grandpa. So yeah, I did vlog a little bit of that as well. It was just kind of like a low key, fun family thing um, at the church. But yeah, we're having fun celebrating Halloween so far. And uh, I'm boring, I never, I don't really like to dress up. I just, I like, my kids love it, and I like getting their costumes and watching them have fun, but I'm just not a big like, costume dress up person but I guess I'm wearing this cardigan so you could call me like a cheetah or something but it's been nice spending time with my family and you just never know like when the last time will be that you get to see the people you love most and I'm not trying to sound like super dramatic right now but it's just true right like you never know how much time you have with the people that you love most and being a dual citizen and like having life and elements of my life in two different countries it makes it just even more like apparent that I need to be present and grateful and just clear out any negative feelings or vibes and just love my family and my friends and and really cherish the time when I get to be around them um, because yeah, time is really all we have and it's really precious and 
Um, so I'm just grateful to be here spending time with some of my closest people in my life and also can't wait to get back to Kenya and continue the memory making and spending time with people we love there. Anyway, let's get into the vlog. Thank you guys for watching and please subscribe. We're getting ready to go to a family Halloween party. And I need a jacket because it's officially cold outside. A lot of people hate the whole time change thing where the winters are shorter days. It gets dark very fast, but I actually kind of like it. It gets old after a while, but I don't know. It just like makes me feel like it's the holidays. The party is at my aunt's church building where they go to church. Paris, sweet Paris, what you doing? Oh, hi, baby. Paris has Paris has to wear this <laughs> this little shield because she has allergies really badly this time of year, and she scratches her ears, and it's so sad. Um, <laughs> she loves to hang out with me. Yeah, spooky bear, you got spooky bear. How about <laughs> this is uh... this is gonna be costume number one for Mills because yeah she has a lineup. Goose. London is out? London is no, princess. No, I'm just gonna leave Please. this and then cut ahead and yeah. yeah. You want a ghost? Yeah. <laughs> I forgot Look the arms. Goes. I forgot arms. <laughs> <laughs> Hold on, I'll get them. Don't put your fingers here. Millie, you're so spooky. I ghost, I didn't. Yeah, you're a ghost. Hey, did you do? <gasps> so spooky. <Yeah>. So spooky. <laughs> Hold it's on. Awesome. Um, bags of chips and those glow bracelets. Let's take them to the park. Uh, Maddie's. Let's go with. Uh, she's out the other way, the front door. Liam, come grab some chips. No, you may not sit in the front. Mm -hmm. You want to touch Coda? Come here, Coda. Say bye to Coda. Say bye, Coda. Bye, Coda. Bye. Bye, bye. <laughs> okay, let's go to the party. There's great grandma. Go say hi to great grandma. Go give her loves. Great grandma. Great grandma. Hi, grandma. Hello, grandma. Good night. Say hi. I'm so happy to be here. Your dress is so good. That looks so good. Hi, pretty girl. You don't take it well.
Hi, Miss Mills. I know, Dad had the heater on last night and it felt so good. No. Do you guys want to go pick the pumpkin that you want off the porch? Go to the grass. Mm -hmm. Hi, Chase. What's up, dude? <laughs> and on to our next family Halloween activity. We're painting pumpkins. Some of us are carving pumpkins. I prefer to paint because carving pumpkins is just a long process because you have to clear out all the insides. And it's not my favorite thing to do. <laughs> Mills, where's your pumpkin? Where is it? Something off your computer? <gasps> wow, that's yours? Yeah. That's so cool. Yeah, okay. Yay. Come here. Come here. The only bluish one is the bluish one is um mermaid cool. Mermaid cake. Mermaid cake. Good in the sun. Mm -hmm. Here, Millie, all the paints are here. See? Yes. Mm. This is our the so good. Four colors. Artist Mills. So good, Millie. Minecraft. Mm. Taking a break? Yeah, break. <laughs> <laughs> break. Small break. Here we, we, pull. Pull. we put this hat back on. 
Spooky. Ooh, spooky, spooky, scary pumpkin. <laughs> You're supposed to do something harder so there's spooky. Oh. Could you have a spider on it? Spider. Yeah. <laughs> That's so. Well, 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 These eyes are not very good. This one. Yeah. Do, do, do. No, it goes. Well, I don't want to make this. Send shivers down your spine. Damn. Looks like a good skew. Probably over there where all those dogs are barking. Probably. To make the hair color. <laughs> 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 so now the last Halloween thing to do is go trick-or-treating on Tuesday and it should be fun. Uh, we're going trick-or-treating in a neighborhood that we've never gone trick-or-treating before and it's supposed to be like the hot spot in town for trick-or-treating so so I will vlog our night of trick-or-treating and upload a fun video separately just for that so uh, look out for that one and that will wrap it up for our Halloween. Thank you guys so much for watching and we'll see you next time.